Lucy Burke here, and it's a Monday time for a grocery haul. Today is the last Monday of 2019. I'm filming this on December 30th, and this is the last grocery haul of 2019. So, we're waiting on 2020. So, probably 2020 already where you're at, because I filmed this a week behind. <laughs> anyway, I went to the grocery store. And it's one of those times. It's so weird. I didn't need much. I just needed a few items. And I thought, ah, it's going to be cheap. Oh, no. It was like $95. $95. Um, and you're going to see I hardly got anything. It's so weird. Sometimes I get so much for 60 bucks, And then sometimes I get so little. But I do have two expensive items. So let me show you what I got. Oh, by the way, I hope everyone had a Merry Christmas. I haven't really talked to you since then, so Merry Christmas. <laughs> um, they have, now that Christmas is done, they have all the cleaning supplies, which is awesome. Um, this was on sale for $9, like, well, actually, 10 bucks, $9.99. And I have a mop, but it's one of those um, sponge mops. And I don't know, they just, it doesn't work that great on me, and I don't, I don't know. I don't see. I don't feel like it gets clean. I miss a real mop. Uh, I just don't like the wringing out stuff. So what I usually do is I have old um, towels, like, you know, not paper towels, but like cloth towels. God, my hair's a mess. Sorry. Um, and I just get down on my knees and I just wipe it. I use Fantastic and I just wipe it with towels because I don't really have big floors or anything. I just have the kitchen and two bathrooms. So that's it. But this one looked interesting. I haven't tried it yet. This is like a regular rope mop and it rings out in, in this tube or something. I don't know. I'll give it a shot. It was like 10 bucks and it's kind of a spur moment thing. So that's probably why it was $95. This was $10 at least. So I'm going to put that to the rest of the stuff. So I got myself a mop and Cat litter is very expensive. This is like $9. They were out of all the cheap stuff. So I had to get the expensive stuff. This is like $9. This is one I used to get, the Tidy Cat Glade. Uh, so I got my cat litter. So that was another uh, almost 10 bucks. So that's 20 bucks right there. So that's pretty much why. And this is another 10 bucks, $8.99. This wasn't on sale. So this is another nine. So that's $30 right there. So I get it. It wasn't on sale, but I thought, what the hell. I'm going around. I'm going to get my favorite toilet paper. It's my favorite toilet paper. It has the aloe vera. It's like nice and moist. And I've been blowing my nose a lot. You know, it, it just works really well. So that's probably, that's 30 bucks right there. So I get it. And of course I got more water. There's more water. What is this? Oh yeah. Coupons that didn't really work out. Uh, I had coupons, but I didn't want anything that coupons had in there. Okay, I got more water, and I got more butter. I got the butter spray. That's like three dollars. I usually get the butter spray. I like this stuff. Um, and then I don't know. I'm trying to get back into red wine, so uh, I got the Yellowtail Big Bold Red. You know, because during the holidays I bought a lot of whiskey. I do a lot of kind of grocery hauls without you guys. I'm sorry because it's Christmas time, and I had to run my my friend uh, Carrie. She had like um. She always does like a, a, a weekend after Christmas party, which is kind of cool. She does a white elephant gift. And so I got some, I had to run, and she needed some supplies too. So I got her some eggnog, a spiked eggnog for the party. And then um, I bought some whiskey and stuff like that for the party and for gifts. And, um, and then everyone gave me whiskey. And so uh, I have a lot of whiskey. And so I like whiskey, don't get me wrong. But once in a while, it's just a little bit too strong. And I'm kind of getting over the eggnog, even though I have a lot of eggnog left over. Because I found some on. Since I had to buy some for uh, Carrie's party, I, um, I had to buy some for me. So I have a bunch of eggnog and stuff like that. But um, I don't know. You know, I'm trying to get back in the wine. I kind of miss just doing my wine and champagne. Um, just normal stuff like that. So I'm trying to get back just doing that instead of just drinking the whiskey. Because... Whiskey, you got to mix it with stuff, and I don't want to do whiskey Cokes, um, 
because it's I don't like the caffeine, I don't like the sugar, and I don't think Coke's good for you. I think the whiskey's probably a lot better for you than the Coca-Cola. So, um, I don't know. You know, I gotta have my glass of wine at, at night time. It's kinda nice. So, um I'm gonna try to get back into it instead of drinking whiskey. I can't drink whiskey. I have a lot of it though. But it's it'll be good for when people come over and maybe even once in a while I drink it. I just gotta I just I've been getting really into the whiskey and I don't wanna get too much into the whiskey. Although it is nice. I I tried like um the apple one. They have so many different flavors. I tried the peach one. The peach one's good but it's sweet. It makes it so sweet. I guess you have to dilute it with ice. But they have all these flavors, and during Christmas time, you know, like, oh, I'll try that one, I'll try, you know. Uh, but I have peach. I haven't opened the apple one. I do like the Winter Jack, which is um, apple cider. It tastes like apple cider. Uh, but it's like 15% alcohol. It's like it's like a wine. It's like drinking wine. Even though it says Jack Daniels on it, it's a lot lower alcohol content. Uh, it's like drinking wine. And it is sweet. And, um, you know me, I got so much sweet stuff. Everyone gave me like cookies and candies and stuff. Hopefully my roommate will like that because uh, I don't know. I'm not really that much into sweet stuff. Like, I'm just not. But anyway, sorry, I'm just kind of like, you know, down. It's like Christmas kind of wiped me out financially. And then like, you know, just like I kind of have the, I guess the, I guess you call it December blues. Where I'm just kind of, you know, I've been in a depressed mode. I've been honest about it for like the, the past two months. And I'm hoping once new year and, and and it'll change and once i clean out like you know because soon as I, I have the decorations still up and i usually don't take all the christmas decorations off until um new year's so i'm, I'm hoping once i clean house and they get rid of like you know just get rid of 2019 i i'll start perking up and i need to save money again because December kind of wiped me out, and I'm like going through my finances like I was doing it in the car, and then when that came up to $95, I was like, so that's why I'm a little, you know, kind of, bleh. I'm a little, plus yesterday, I didn't really do anything except just watch TV, binge watch TV, and so I felt really not productive, so anyway, sorry to give you a Debbie Downer, let's go back to the fun grocery haul, <laughs> sorry, <laughs> okay, I got wine, and, um, since it's going to be New Year's, uh, champagne is New Year's toast. So I got two bottles of um, Andre Brut champagne. Um, I also have good champagne. I just don't drink it for myself. If someone wants to come over and toast, or so I'll use the good champagne or I'll bring it over for parties. But for me, I like the Andre. I like the Andre. I'm not going to open a good bottle of champagne just for myself. Because... I don't really taste a difference. Plus, good champagne, even though it's good, I don't drink it all, so it's just going to go flat. And also, it it's stronger. Like, that one, like, the Andre is, like, so weak. It's like, I could drink, like, a couple glasses and I'm fine. But the good champagne knocks me on my butt because it's stronger, I think. I think. I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe it's the bubbles. I don't know. But it gets stronger for me. I was running out of bread because I do. I like my toast in the morning. So I got my 12 grain, just normal bread. It's like $1.99. And that's not on sale. That's a normal price. And I'm getting more tortillas because I always have to have tortillas on hand. And I don't know. I don't even mean to get organic. They were just on sale for $1.99. So I got some tortillas. Oh, for New Year's, I grabbed this. It was only $5. I thought, what the hell? Uh, I might do a video on this. But this is like. Happy New Year, um, tiaras, which I like, and streamers, and uh, I just got those. It was like five bucks. I'm like, why not? Why not be festive? And then I was running out of um, big tri uh, trash bags, so I got the black trash bags. These I use for, like, lots of things, like when I want to just dump a bunch of things. The trash bags for my kitchen, I like the white trash bags, the tall ones, but these are for, like, heavy-duty stuff. So I was running out of those. Of course, baby wipes. I get my unscented baby wipes all the time. Oh, oh yeah. This is for the poo poo. This is for the cat litter. These are 97, 97 cents. These are just tall kitchen trash bags. And then they had all the cleaning supplies. So I grabbed, they were on sale, some sponges. Like, I don't know, $3. So they said a dollar sponge. 
So I got some more sponges, even though I didn't need them. I have some stocked up. But, you know, it's one of the things you don't want to run out of. So I got more sponges. And this was interesting. I don't do equal. I do stevia. But you know how I was, I was, they were running out of gingerbread? They, I haven't found gingerbread creamer. This is equal, but it's gingerbread cookie flavored equal. I don't know. It was on sale because they're getting rid of all their Christmas stuff. Um, and I don't usually do equal because it's it's known to like um like all those artificial sweeteners are known to like they cause brain cancer. They cause then it's not good for you. So that's why I do the stevia. Um, but I gotta give this a try. So I'm gonna put that. I guess I'm gonna put that right there. There. Yeah. <coughs> and this is my receipt. All right. Oh. Let's see. Of course, I got more cheese. Every time I go to the store, I gotta get more cheese. Some marble cheese. Yay! 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 I had this last night, and this was good. Usually, I didn't think I would like the Italian vegetable, but I ate this whole thing last night. 740 calories. Um, thanks. But I ate the whole thing. I didn't think I was going to eat the whole thing. I ate a little bit, then I ate a little bit, then I, then I took a nap, and then I watched some TV. It was like a lazy day yesterday. But I put, when I, since it was my pizza, I didn't care. I ate all the vegetables first. I picked all the vegetables. The vegetables were really good. Actually, this pizza is really good. So I had to get another one. It's just uh, $4.99. It's just the Ralph's uh, brand Italian vegetables. It's really good. I like it. Uh, and I don't know why I got this. I don't need it. But it's um, sweet potatoes. It was on sale for $0.99. Cents. I don't know if I could give it to the birds. I gotta. I don't think they could eat it because it's too much sugar. Um, I'd have to Google if parakeets could eat sweet potatoes. I might give it to them for a treat if they can have it, but I don't think they can. But I did get them broccoli slaw last week. Um, I don't know why I'm saying the broccoli slaw has been getting like it, it spoils really quickly. It, it's it it bruises, and this one's starting to bruise again too. And usually broccoli slaw lasts me in the refrigerator for a while, so I don't know what's going on with it. So this was 99 cents. So this is just like a bunch of stir fried vegetables. So I got this for backup for the birds in case um, it, that broccoli slaw doesn't last until next Monday. So I got the more vegetables. And last but not least, you know, I'm going through my pizza phase because it's what I like. These are like a dollar each and they're just like just a single cheese pizza so you could add your own stuff to them. Um, and so this is what I've been eating. For dinner, I just been eating pizza. I mean, yeah, I snack on things like you know chips or you know I might snack you know make some toast or um, stuff like a tortilla and some cheese. But basically, this is my dinner, and I'm fine with it. I'm totally fine with it. Sorry, I'm not so uppity uppity. Sorry, I'll snap out of it. I promise, I'll snap out of it. Oh, I'm wearing my sweet uh, shirt. The band's the sweet. I went to go see them in concert. Um, I think last month. It was good back of it. I don't know what it says, but probably all their um, stuff. <laughs> Alright, well I'm going to put this stuff away because uh, I got to get going a lot of things. I got to clean the house. I just got a lot of stuff I need to do. And I got to snap out of this mood. And I, I promise I will because I've been saying that for two months. I know. But I'm really hoping once the new year, once I clean the house and get things ordered because I feel like I'm just waiting because I can't do anything until I take off the lights and do this and do that. So I'm kind of waiting for the new year. So hopefully that'll help snap me out of it. All right. To all my stage cadets and all my briquettes, I hope you have a great day. Until next time.